Yo, what's going on guys? Jordan here again and welcome to episode number 9, I believe, of Trading to the Big Money. And we left off last episode with around 300k, so we managed to smash that just in the 8th episode, so I'm pretty happy about that. And hopefully we'll be continuing our journey to the big money. Um, I'm not quite decided whether it be 500k or a million, but I'll let you guys decide that later on. But anyway, let's get straight into this, and the first player we're going to pick up is a left back for Real Sociedad. Uh, he is Jose Angel and he is a silver in form and he actually came out in this week's in, in team of the week so his price was varying as I picked him up on the day and this is like the best bargain of the episode as I picked him up for 50.5k on an open bid and I put him up for 79k and he actually goes within like 2 minutes of putting him up but I did actually see another one going for 93k after that so I was a bit gutted but his price has gone way down now so I was happy about selling him up for that price then the next two two players we're going to pick up here is first off an El Sharawi, who we pick up for 20, no, sorry, 20, 10.5k. I'm going to try and sell him on for 14.75k, converted to a, no, not, is he a left mid? Yes, he is a left mid, we're a catalyst on. And we have to pick up a Nietzsche who's converted to a centre mid all the way down from striker. And he's got catalyst on as well, so that's the only way I picked him up for 3k. And I'm going to put him off for 7k, I think, in the first place. But then I might just pick him, sell him up for 5k in the end. Then the next person we're going to pick up is a Shadow Hamshik. Um, pretty good player to be honest. And we pick him up for 1.4k and try and sell him on for 2.9k. Now the next player we're going to pick up is a centre defensive mid Gerard. So he's been converted from centre mid. And we're going to pick him up with that catalyst on. Pick him up for 8.8k. It was an absolute bargain considering how much we're going to sell him on for. As you'll see on the screen now. It is around... 14k maybe, no 13 and a half k, and that is a nice profit on him. Now the next player we're gonna pick up after that is a Danny, um, left mid for I can't quite remember what team that is. But we're picking up for 3k, and we're gonna try and sell him on for around 5.3k, and we do it sell him for that in the end. Then we're gonna pick up a drug bear for 1.8k um, on an open bid, so that was a pretty good die, and we're gonna sell him on for 3.1k with that catalyst on. And then straight after that, you're going to see the bid and tick down. I just managed to pick up a Sanchez in a right mid. Um, so he's been converted from right wing, I believe, with that catalyst on. I'm going to try and sell him on for our... Oh, I can't remember. Something like 5k or something like that. Maybe a bit more. Um, it was a struggle to actually sell. Yeah, 5.9k is bid, but I have to sell him 5k in the end. It was a bit of a struggle to pick up. I mean, sell on. But, nevertheless, still managed to make a nice profit on him. And then the next player we're going to pick up is an uh, Informed Kalu. Right mid. For Liam, I believe that is, in the French League. 13.5k, we're catalyst on him. And we're going to try and sell him on for around 16k. Now the next player we're going to pick up is a Bernard with that catalyst on. As you notice, I love trading with catalyst. I've said this in previous episodes, so easy. Um, anyway, we pick him up, convert to a centre attacker mid for 2.4k. And we're going to try and sell him for 4.8k. So a nice little profit in him, around about 2k. Then we managed to pick up with Negredo as well, who we were bidding on at the same time, for 1.5k with that catalyst on. We're going to try and sell him on for around 3.5k. And um, we do manage to sell for around 3.1k in the end, but still managed to make a nice profit on him. And then after that, we're going to pick up a uh, centre mid, Modric. I think he's being converted from a centre attacking mid with that catalyst on again. Um, and we do pick him up for 7.6k, no, 7.9k, 6k. I can't read that though when I'm recording this, but... You'll see on the screen, and we managed to sell him for 9.5k. And we also bid on the David Villa as well, um, with that catalyst on him. And we pick one for 4.5k, and we're going to try and sell him on for a nice profit as well. So I managed to pick up tons of players with that catalyst on, and some players with that shadow chemistry style on. Um, if you haven't seen the method I use for this, go and check it out. I'll leave a link to that in the description. It's so effective and. I managed to pick up loads of players, and the final player of this episode is a Coutinho, centre attacker mid for Liverpool, my favourite team, and we pick him up for 3.8k, and we're going to try and sell him on for I believe around 5.7k, oh 5.9k, but anyway, that's the end of this episode guys, and I believe once we sold everyone, we'll be on around 350k, so that's so much nice profit this episode, Um, as you can see on the screen is my Twitter, uh, I've got around 20 followers at the minute, 12 followers at the minute, should I say. Once I get around 20 followers, I will start tweet tweeting out um, trading tips, up to date, etc. That can help you guys out. But anyway, if you enjoyed the episode, leave a like as always. 
comment if, um, comment if you want to ask any questions, if you got any doubts about the videos, etc. And subscribe if you want to see more content like this. I'm so close to 100 subscribers, which I am absolutely blown away by, considering I've only just kind of started doing this sort of stuff. And hopefully you guys will continue to support me. But until next time, guys, have a great day and see ya.